Help! Help me! Nani? Hey, it's our boy! Which I forgot his name already. Hey, 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 guys! Um, I know, welcome back to another video. We're gonna be playing, you know, the Zelda Mishcap. And well, we already know what happened. Princess Zelda got turned into a uh, stone, you know. Rip. And well, yeah. Also, there's gonna be a bit of delay of a delay for some of the videos. I know. I'm sorry. Oh, I got a bit lip. It hurts. Either way, this is gonna. There's gonna be a bit of a delay for some of my for some of my videos. So, all I want to say is please um subscribe, like and subscribe. It's not the end of the video. I just want to say like and subscribe. Okay. Stand by my side. The king of Hyrule is about to speak. Is it? Is it? Is it as all you have heard? A sorcerer named Vati has struck my fair and turned her into stone. If we had the scattered blade, we would likely have broken the curse. But Vali shattered the blade. Uh, however, I. <clears throat> I have not given up hope. What do you know about Pokori? Pokori. The Pokori, not much. Beyond the, the fairy tales say, they're supposed to be very tiny if I'm remembering correctly. Yes, the ones from the fairy tales. But the Pokori are no more, no, no mere legend. They are mostly certainly exist. No one outside of the royal family knows the truth about them. The Pokori, but Cory, um, who forged the scattered blade, live deep within the mesh woods. I'm sorry, guys. Um, they should be able to repair the broken blade and f reforge the sword. What? When we must detach the soldiers there at once. No, no soldiers. No soldiers will not do. The Cory do not show themselves to anyone but children. Our soldiers could search for days and still find no sign of them. I see. If that's the case, then why not send Link? If Link can recover, then if Link has recovered, then yes, I would like to ask him for this. Please turn my presence of the back to normal. Will do. The Bakori should know how to create a new scattered sword. It will it will be dangerous. It will be a dangerous journey now that those monsters have been freed. Please take this sword with you along with the broken Pokori blade. Uh, you accepted the broken Pokori blade. All right. Nice. As I said before, there's going to be a bit of a delay on some of my videos. I'm sorry. Oh, uh, please forgive me. Okay. I've been lazy with the quarantine stuff. And well, um, there's been some assignments I had to do from school, which is kind of doo doo, but I, fin I managed to finish them. So I might upload more. I'm gonna start, you know, making constant videos because my mom's not here. I'll just say, yeah, I only make videos when my mom is in here because, you know, because, <coughs> you know, I don't like when people, there's noise and stuff. So I'm in my mom's closet. The door mostly shuts out some of the noise, so it should be good. So you might hear a bit of background noise. I'm sorry for that. I would fix it, but I can't. Also, I'm saving up for a laptop, which I want to get so bad. So I could probably record some of my uh, Nintendo Switch gameplays. But I'm not sure if I'm going to get the Elgato capture card. But I'm not sure if it'll work with my Nintendo Switch Lite. You know, I got the Lite. It's kind of sad, but it's alright. It's a Switch, so eh. You can play Resident. Evil, you can play Resident Evil on it, so that's cool. Just press Start and L or R to open. I marked the locations of the forest. Yeah, yari yari daze. <clears throat> you got a map of Hyrule. Now you'll never get lost. I'm counting on you, Link. You can break Vata's curse and free Princess Zelda. All right, no more exploring. I don't. There's obviously nothing to explore here because I played a bit of the game already, so I actually made um part I made three videos of this, but I accidentally deleted them, so I had to redo the whole thing. 
sadly but eh. either way it was actually i really enjoyed looking for the place it was kind of fun so it just shouldn't take me long to you know look and find the place north hyrule field uh the classical music feels so good playing like playing a zelda game it's fun you know just seeing that little kid oh wait what oh there go b i don't know why i'm so used to pressing a but yeah I also played Ocarina of Time. Oh wait, yeah, there you go. So, I played Ocarina of Time, which was actually a good game. I really enjoyed. Um, I really enjoyed. The game was quite fun. Not gonna lie. Uh, I beat, uh, I beat the original one. You know, the regular Legends of Ocarina of Time. But I'm stuck on the Master Quest. I'm still walking a walkthrough. You got one rupee. It's green. Don't spend it all at one place. Alright, I won't. Ooh, a heart. You got a heart. This repels your life energy a little bit. Oh, crap. So, I'm gonna kill some enemies. Because, you know, I want some rupees. So obviously, I'm gonna... Oh, wow. Alright, so what we're gonna do is head to Kokori area. Which should be here. And... Oh, Lon Lon Ranch. To be honest, Legends of the Ocarina of Time also has Lon Lon Ranch. But I don't think... But the music is a lot different though. And I like it. And yeah. The music from Legends of the Ocarina of Time is different. But, you know, they still have the same features. So, yeah. Anyway, we're going to get quite far, I believe. So, um, let's see. Where is this down here? Eastern Hills. Alright, so I remember because I played actually played a bit. I was kinda, you know, wanting, you know, what what's it like to play in Zelda game? Sorry, that's not my notifications right there. I watch a lot of YouTube just to let you know. Yeah. Oh yeah, three rupees. That's nice. You could probably, you know, buy stuff. Oh okay, uh I think it's here. Yeah. The Mish Woods. So Okay, I don't want to spoil anything because, you know, for people who want to see the game gameplay of this, since none of you guys have a Game Boy Advance. Also, I'm going to be making a video on how to um, download, well, yeah, download um, the full version, aka no ads, um, my boy, for or a GBA emulator. The, the, GBA, the GBA emulator works for all devices, but I think, but not iOS. Only like Android. It only works for Android, not iOS. Sadly, but there are some emulators for the iOS. But I'm not gonna review. I'm not gonna review it because you know I don't have an iOS and I'm not an iOS user. So you know, so we can't go through there. Look at this tiny pond which we easily drown in if we're tiny. Ow! Damn it! God, these controls. I keep clicking the wrong button. Hold up. Let me pause this game real quick. Yeah, this is the emulator I'm using. Um, I could actually change the button controls right now, which I'm gonna do. Uh, video screen. Uh, a bit like that, a bit like that, you know, right there. You know, I have a gamer. Uh, close. Oh, the screen. Hold up. I gotta add something. Add a control. A and B, which I always need to add. I always add A and B, which is, you know, convenient for me, because just in case I have to press both, both, both buttons. Alright, uh, let's go here. <clears throat> help! Help me! <laughs> Nani? Hey, it's our boy! Which I forgot his name already. Only got about, like, this far? No, not yet. I will, I will help me, somebody. Can't, can anybody hear me? No, oh, gotta go rescue that dude. I'm gonna go here. I like the sound effects when you step on the ponds. It's kind of door. I like it. Just, you know, just hearing that. Okay, there you go. Because the volume is a bit loud, so I have to keep, you know, one ear. Well, I'm gonna make a video. I make. I'm starting to make upload more videos, and I'm already gonna order. I'm gonna order some stuff. You know, just letting you guys know. I know it's a lot of information, but I know you guys want to get the gameplay. So, hey, kid, you there? 
Ow! Hey, don't just stand there. Do something. Ow! What's wrong with you? Do you like watching me get take this abuse? Help me. Ah, crap. Hell yeah. Phew, well done. That was a close. Not that I could have handled it myself, but that's besides the point. I'm... What in the world is a lone child doing so deep in the woods? Ho ho, I see. The Pokori, you say? And Vati? Vati's cursed someone? What? Scattered blade? Is that so? I see, I see. You know, you and I have quite a lot in common. You see, I... I too am on a quest to break the curse of Vati's and you say that bro getting the scattered blade is cursed. Well then you found yourself a companion my boy. My name is Ezolo. Ez Ezolo, it's a pleasure to meet your acquaintance. Hey. hey wait, I say wait, you walk so quickly, too quickly in fact. I can't go on, can you go on these floor? Surely you haven't noticed I have no legs. Boy, take a look. Take a good look at me. Do you really think I could walk fast? Ah, if this isn't if, if this isn't one thing, it's another. You are a troublemaker, boy. There. Now you can possibly leave me behind. My, it's quite comfortable up here. More comfortable than it looks, surely. And much easier on me. Hey, quit your smirking. Can you still see? See? Yeah. Yes. Yes, that is it. Much better. Now, I'm supposed I suppose a boy like you still has to learn about the world. Even if you ever need my my sight sense, press select. I will be happy to help. Which is the button bottom you know that? What? I haven't even had time to settle in and you're bothering me? Deep in the woods, shining lights obviously enough to, okay, I already know. Uh so my superior senses okay, I don't care. So we're gonna go here and we're gonna shrink, obviously. Hold on for a moment, my boy. We have stumbled across something important. The the world of Mish the Mish is really small. You're far too big to meet them now. Huh? Who are the Mish? Ah yes, silly me. Allow me to explain. Humans call them Pokori, but they're most but they refer to themselves as Mish. Strange how, how in the world of humans, only the forest has kept the name. Anyhow, deep in the forest, they built a village where many, how many I'll live. But if you're, if we, <clears throat> but if you're to enter the village, you'll have to speak to, you have to, have to make you a touch smaller first. Look at that. At first glance, it appears to be a Morse bump. Mm, no, that bump is a portal used by people. <clears throat> oh my god, I'm running like a robot, bro. Uh, with my help, you you can use it to shrink down to Mish eyes. Just stand on the stump and press that. And then, okay, to return to normal, stand and R. Get up there and you'll have to give it a try. Alright, okay, first I'm gonna go get water. I'll be back. Alright, I'm back from getting a drink of water. And we're gonna start right now. Oh my god. Ugh. Ugh. Okay guys, I do not have coronavirus. <clears throat> Welcome to the world through the eyes of the Mish. Now, aren't you glad you saved me? No need to thank me though. Portals that reduce your size are all small around in different shapes and sizes. If you want to return to normal, stand next to the portal and press R. But there are there are one thing you must know. Being Mish size is full of dangers. Mere puddles of your normal size are bottomless swamps to the mish. And as your companion, if anything bad happens to you, it happens to me too. So proceed with caution, my lad. If not, for your sake. Then for my own. Exactly. Bro, I like how you little face right there, like. Yeah, there, bro, look how tiny I am. So, my dumb dumb, you know. Oh, snap. Hold up, wait a minute. Damn it! Aw, oh, come on. Bro, how am I dying? Oh, crap. Oh, uh, let's see. Oh, okay, crap. Oh. This is actually cool. To be honest, I actually like the way it's drawn for a Game Boy Advance. 
And look at this. Look at the art style. It looks nice. Especially how you get to explore, you know, the small. It gives you what? This is basically a view of how, you know, little people live. I don't know. If this is a view of ants, basically. This is what this is how ants see the world. Parkour, 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 parkour. I gather, I gather it's been quite some time since they last saw a human. What's that? You didn't understand what they were saying just now? Ah, yes, that was the language of the Mish. It's, it's a little, it's a little different from the, the lake. I am. I'm familiar with. I'm afraid I didn't catch most of what they said myself, but perhaps there is someone here who understands your language. We should look around. So obviously I know what that place is. When I first got here, I was actually completely lost, but I know where it's at, so. I think it's here. This is so nice. Like, imagine living in a tiny place like this. Well, not really tiny, but yeah, let's talk to this dude. Hmm, I've been, I've been, a, I've never seen an outfit like that before. Are you a human? Oh my, it's quite, it's, oh my, it's been some, it's been quite some time since any human came here. My name is Fastari. I watched the Abbey as well as the Shrine to the North. You seem to be having some trouble with our language, don't you? You could use a jabberna. It will allow you to understand our tongue. You should be able to find one in the bar in the barrel house just south here. Okay, thank you. Um, I already forgot your name because you know I'm horrible with names. I cannot. I have a hard time remembering your name. I don't know if it's the Alzheimer's or I'm just stupid. Obviously I am, but you know. I think it should be here. I'm assuming. Hold on. Why can I not go down? Well, they have the crawling animation. Oh, hold up. Ah, uh, here it is. Juggernaut. Oh, Link. This must be the Juggernaut Festival told you about. <clears throat> told you about. Well, you better gather. You better eat it if you plan on making any progress at all. Alright. Cool. Uh, you ate the Juggernaut. Now you can understand the language of the Pakori. Pakori. Alright. Well guys, that's gonna do it for this video. Please hit that like button. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more content like this. And also comment comment down below hashtag link and GB. No, just hashtag link if you want more videos like this. And well yeah, that's gonna do it. Alright, uh peace.